guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jalisa. Welcome to my channel if you are new and welcome back if you are back. <laughs> I'm standing here today in front of our tiny, tiny linen closet. And as you can see, it is a mess. And I have been so tempted to just get in here and organize it. My mom was here over the Thanksgiving holiday and she bought me like some towels and some different things. So I am really excited to just get into this and start to organize this mess. <laughs> okay. First, I'm gonna start by just taking everything out and putting them somewhere, I don't know. Right now I'm just like washing the um, towels and drying them. A lot of the towels we've had for like a really long time. I don't even know if I can give them away to like Goodwill or something. Could someone comment below and tell me because I think it's kind of gross to give away towels and sheets. But anyway, I'm going to try and figure out what I can do with um, these things. So let's get started guys. All right, so this is my linen closet. I have towels in here, sheets in here. Just It was just so much stuff that sometimes I wouldn't even use them. I have that container there with like different party bags, Christmas bags to like give gifts in case we go to a party unannounced. I kind of like try to organize it with one shelf being just like nail stuff, but it's just too much. So I'm just gonna take everything out here and get started. What did you expect now? That you feel better? I tell no simple lies. What did you come? The shelves really weren't in bad shape, so I just took like a Clorox wipe and I wiped across the um the shelves, but they really weren't in bad shape. Alright, so now it's all clear and it's time to finally start the fun part. <laughs> my camera's battery is dying and I still have a whole bunch of stuff that I need to get done um I guess I can plug it in for a little while and while I plug it in I'm basically gonna go through all of these things and see what I'm gonna keep and what I'm not gonna keep because some of these things need to go in different areas like this needs to go all of these stuff therefore the girls tents they need to go up to the playroom and then noe noe can you be quiet please can you go over there noe do you want to go noe do you want to go upstairs like figure out what i want down here and what i don't want down here and by the time i'm finished um you guys should be charged up a little bit more <laughs> So now I'm just trying to figure out where everything is going to go. Those baskets, I got those from, would you call those baskets? So like a storage box. I got those from Target for like $5.99. And then the acrylic containers, I got those from TJ Maxx for about $12.99. I think three of them came in one set, which was a really good deal. And then I got that glass container from Walmart for I think $8.99. So it was really a good deal. All right, so I kind of like went through everything that I'm gonna keep and everything that I'm gonna give away or throw away. And then in here, I just kind of like put what I want, like how the baskets would fit. Honestly, I don't know what's gonna go in all of the baskets, but I think I'm gonna figure that out along the way. I know that I want like maybe like some towels on this side, then towels here, towels here. And then like maybe I can put like my sheets and duvet covers in here. And then like the girls, they have like nail polish products and things like that, that they kind of like keep in here and like their makeup stuff. So I'm going to find somewhere to put them in here. And at the bottom, I'm going to put like some blankets that we use and like some throws in a basket as well at the bottom. I also have this. 
I can possibly put like their nail polish and stuff in this. It's like a little cosmetic thing and it turns. So I decided to actually roll the washcloth. I thought it would look really cute in that little acrylic container. I know I'm from the Caribbean, but trust me, the only thing that I know how to roll is probably a sushi roll and washcloths. That, that's it. That's it. <laughs> We won't ever come down, we won't ever come down low Running from a ghost town, where we never feel high to slow We won't ever come down, we won't ever come down low so I decided to go with teal, white, and gray because I just think it's a really good combination. I wanted to do pink at first, but then I was like, nah, everything in the house is pink and Marley's favorite color is teal. So I decided to go with teal and those white towels just came out of the dryer. So I'm just putting everything in. And then these are some decorative stuff that I have. Like when I, when my mom, <laughs> comes like she buys all of these things to like decorate the bathroom and things like that so i decided to put those in there with like the duvet covers my mom actually thrifted that basket from a thrift store and you're gonna also see another basket where i put the throws in my mom also thrifted that one as well i don't have that kind of patience but my mom does and she finds like really 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 cute finds at the thrift store so, so far it's coming along really nice. Um, I'm just going through all of the girls' little makeup stuff. I keep them downstairs so that I can keep an eye on them when they put nail polish on or makeup on because it can get all over the place. And little Miss Noe came back downstairs and she is helping me organize the things. And I just let her because this is where she wants to be right next to her mom, right, right next to me. <laughs> So this is the final product. I cannot believe that I transformed my junky, tiny linen closet into this clean, aesthetically pleasing space. It's just so beautiful. And if you guys made it to the end of the video, please give me a like, comment, let me know if I can donate old towels to the Goodwill, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys, bye. Watch me dancing in the colors, lightning, blowing up a thunder, wash it up.